years ago. I don't know what 30 days is. So I, I left still not understanding what the fuck he's talking about. So once I left, I didn't I didn't complete none of the motherfucking hours of the community service within that 30 days. I ain't complete I ain't give them motherfuckers not one dime on a motherfucking fine. So then I started going to court with the Galactic Federation of Light, cause then they started attacking me in the astral realm and shit. But I'm powerful up there too. See that? See that? See that's how it is. If you're not consciously, subconsciously, or unconsciously aware, they you might do something down here. Like man, fuck it, I'm gonna go ahead and steal something from a store, right? And then once you get caught, you get caught and have to go to court and shit like that. They they start attacking you in the astral realm. And if you're not aware, they attack you up there and start opposing all feeling, guilty feelings on you. Like you're guilty about something. Nigga, how are you guilty because you went and stole a fucking candy bar? Guilty to whose law? Like, guilty to who? You know what I'm saying? They start attacking you. Start throwing uh, the, the guilt paradigm on you. Start throwing a... Uh, you, and then once you accept you're guilty, you go to court. And then once the judge say, do you accept these responsibilities... Take responsibility for what you did. Once you say yeah and go ahead and do whatever the judge tell you to do, you agree to them terms and conditions. So now you don't even know what's going on. And you and you think you're doing the right thing by by sub subjecting yourself to their to their their law of the land. You know what I'm saying? And they made you feel guilty and you really got that guilt feeling in you. I'm not guilty for shit. Wow, how the fuck I'm going to be guilty because I'm driving without, because I ain't go through y'all procedures to drive on, on, on my land. So basically you telling me I'm not allowed to drive on y'all land because I didn't go through the procedures that y'all want me to go through to be able to drive? You got a lot of 3D punk ass motherfuckers right now that look at me too and be like, nigga, you got to do that shit. You got to think I got to do shit. That's your shit. That ain't my shit, nigga. That's your shit. But like I said, I brought that shit down there, went to court. You know what he took? He asked me, "Is there a reason you didn't, you didn't, uh, you 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 didn't uh, complete, you didn't complete no hours of community service, and uh, and you didn't, um, and you didn't pay a cent, nigga? I'm mentally prepared for them to take me to jail because that can't even hold me." Anything else I could give a fly fuck about. Nigga, I'm going to tell you what the fuck I feel like. You know what I told him? I told him I didn't know what to do. I didn't get the I didn't get the right explanation. I wasn't explained what I was supposed to do. Because when I because he because look, when I went to court the month before that, he said, "I'm going to give you 30 days." Listen, in my heart, in my mind, in my in my sphere of reality, I don't know what 30 days is. So if you really if, if you really carry that, then it's nothing they can do to you. It's only when when you're not aware and then they attack you from the in the astral realm and attack you down here. Once you start feeling like you are guilty a little bit, but you're trying to talk your way out of it, and then you start lying about shit, like they got you. Listen, they they can't hold me. Like I really, really, it's really not in my mind to actually know what the fuck is 30 days. So he couldn't tie no kind of paradigms to me to make me feel any certain way. So he had no choice but to say, you know what, don't worry about it. He said, don't worry about it. Don't worry about the community service. And he gave me an extension of another 30 days to have the fine paid. And I still don't know what 30 days is. So since he didn't, since he didn't kick the community service out the way, he's going to have to kick the fine out, out the way. Because I'm not throwing a cent on that either. So they're going to send another letter for me to come back to court and say well, you didn't pay nothing on a fine. I'm going to tell them the same thing I told them for them to kick the community service out. I didn't know what to do. They might not even send no other letter or nothing like that that have anything to do with no fine. Nigga, I, I didn't actually, they just actually couldn't hold me. They just couldn't hold me. That's point blank period. They couldn't hold me. You know what I'm saying? That's just it. Because I don't have the ramifications or the or the, the physical alternative or the sunlight that's shedding light on being guilty and all that shit. I don't I'm not governed by none of that shit. I'm not governed by their law. Like, but for but really, really, like, you can't you can't just say that shit and have this shit in the back of your head. Cause once it's in the back of your head, it's gonna manifest and shit like that. Listen, when I went to court in the back of my head, in my subconscious, unconscious, and subconscious mind, that the guilt program was not in there at all. Like, when he looked at me, he could actually see me not being aware of 30 days. 
So it was nothing he can do. Like, it was nothing he can do. You feel me? You have to live this shit. You can't just learn this shit. You gotta live this shit. See, a nigga like me, I, I didn't have to learn it. Like, I actually was always this. You know what I'm saying? A nigga like me had to actually learn the, what time it is. And learn all that shit. When I was born, I didn't know about none of that shit. Nigga, I brought the same consciousness I had. Whatever other body I was in and before I came into this body, I, I had already had this fucking knowledge. I had to actually learn time. Actually learn their worldview on my land. I, I had to learn their shit. And then, and then me growing up, I didn't want to abide by it. Like, I was born this way. I didn't have to abide by it. You have a lot of people who have to get awakening. They, they dealing with karma issues and shit like that that's tying them down to the point that they're so 3D. They have to learn their way back out. I didn't have to learn this. I had to learn the shit that people grew up in. Like, what time it is. And, uh... Do you need a job and all that shit? I had to learn that kind of shit, nigga. This, this shit that I already, the shit that I'm kicking right now, shit I already knew when I was born here. You know what I'm saying? This is shit. This is the real shit, nigga. I took the information I took from before the land of law that I, that I'm seeing in this time, in this time frame, in this lifetime. The shit that they got going on now, like with government and shit like that. I had to learn that shit, but I'm but I'm opposing it from knowledge that I didn't had forever, from millions of lifetimes. In, a, in another lifetime, I ain't had nothing to do with these kind of systems. It was another system. I still had this same knowledge. That's how you know this knowledge is the truth. And the knowledge they trying to impose on you is false. If you got a motherfucking cop who going to stop you and tell you you shouldn't be driving, you don't have license and insurance, they're trying to teach you something on their paradigm. And he ain't nothing but a, a part puck ass a puck ass somebody who work in the Galactic Federation of Light in the Astral Realm. And if he ain't even aware of that, he's being controlled. You know what I'm saying? Gotta get with this shit. Get with this shit, nigga. Get with this motherfucking shit. You can't hold me. You know what I'm saying? And and this is this is and back to the negativity program. This is well as y'all got assets to y'all got uh Y'all got a way of getting a hold of negativity program? I do too. And I have no problem using the negativity pro program against you. You feel me? Flight boss, bitch. Flight boss journey through the motherfucking sky, man. And I'm finna start getting on, getting into details on y'all motherfuckers. I'm gonna start getting into details on y'all motherfuckers. You feel me? I'm gonna let y'all look at my little rock collection too and shit. You know what I'm saying? Look at this shit. Look what I got on my walls. Y'all, y'all motherfuckers, see y'all understanding? I'm, in, I'm in fucking paradise. This, the, this the type of shit I got on my walls, with the little fucking, with the tree. This, this the type of shit I got on my shit. Fuck, what is paint? Fuck a paint. I go somewhere and get a wallpaper and 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 put real shit of how I want my vibrations to be at, in my shit. These my notes and shit that I carry, nigga. I, I got, I got the true earth and the true land inside my house. You feel me? I got I brought this shit to me. This is my land. Flight boss, bitch. 